Of course, we can broadcast now. Mm. So this is the machine I am trying to develop mm -hmm. with a notebook to have all this feature. Mm. So if you click here, you have a camera input, you have a external input. Now I'm trying to make a, a Chromecast connection mm -hmm. to show my handphone video to there. Mm -hmm. I'm testing now. This is the PowerPoint file. Mm -hmm. So uh, you can use any PowerPoint file. Mm -hmm. So th this PowerPoint file you can change to show what the eStudio is. Mm -hmm. So eStudio is a self one person mm -hmm. broadcast station to have live presentation over the smart device in the world. Mm -hmm. So right now our video can go everywhere. You can show to Nepal, fri Nepal friends, for example. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <coughs> the only limitation right now is how we combine presentation mm -hmm. uh, to one smart video. Mm -hmm. So presentation means we need a teacher and presenting material. Mm -hmm. The presenting material can be video mm -hmm. or any a picture mm -hmm. or a PowerPoint file. Basically, PowerPoint is the most convenient tool to show presenting material. Mm -hmm. So for every people showing, mm -hmm. presenting material on the project screen mm -hmm. and teacher on the classroom. That's why students have to come to class to watch the lesson. Mm -hmm. What I am trying is we can combine teacher and teaching material mm -hmm. in a smart way mm -hmm. so people can see this video mm -hmm. from their smartphone, yeah. from anywhere in the world, in any time. Mm -hmm. They can see, they can understand at least better or same quality of lesson mm -hmm. from remote place. Mm -hmm. So we call this is a tele-presentation system mm -hmm. because tele-presentation never happened so far. Mm -hmm. Tele-presentation always uh, people think impossible. Mm -hmm. they, they think the teacher should be in front of the students. Mm -hmm. Teaching material has to be on the classroom. Mm -hmm. But right now we are transferring this information into smart device so every people in the world can see. Mm. Once this is really true, mm. that students can watch from anywhere mm. to lessen any class in the world, mm. we can make a new tele-school, tele-classroom, tele-conferencing, really doing presentation remotely. This is what we are trying and I, I would like to have a new virtual class from for example, America school, England school, mm -hmm. uh, Hong Kong school to make a remote lecture from there to Nepal. Mm -hmm. So Nepal has a good education without investing huge mm -hmm. construction of schools mm -hmm. or teacher bring the teachers there. Mm -hmm. So this message is quite uh, new and I'm very uh, uh, solitude uh, to persuade this message to every people. But this is a true, it's like you're watching. If I, if I bring my mouse over here, the teacher don't have to do anything. Teacher just uh, bring the mouse here mm -hmm. and pointing here and changing PowerPoint from the mouse. Mm -hmm. And then once he it doesn't do anything and speech to, to students, students can be uh, the other side, for example. We can use high vision, whatever, on the right side. So there we can show on other side of students there. So while he's teaching to the students, or while he's speaking to the students in this window, and automatically all scene change made by intelligent way. So he don't have to worry about switching, mixing. He j just wants to, he should concentrate on power slide change only. Mm -hmm. And then if he try to move this pointer over here, they automatically bring this screen big. So students has to mm -hmm. concentrate on watching this. That's the basic idea, but most important is, it's like a broadcaster doing, we should make a beautiful scene output. Mm -hmm. If you compare this scene, mm -hmm. and this scene is different. Mm -hmm. That's what we are trying to make a, a augmented studio here. Mm -hmm. And after this, we, we have all the seamless uh, integration with uh, existing video conferencing or broadcast software, mm -hmm. like uh, Skype. Yes. or Hangout, Zoom, iVision, everything is uh, uh, smoothly integrated here. So we can, we can bring any conferencing program on this side. Mm -hmm. So we can use existing mm -hmm. 
mm-hmm. powerful video conference or a broadcast software here. Even we can do, uh, for example, here we have uh, uh, the uh, Facebook. Mm-hmm. So in this Facebook, we can open. Then uh, here, uh, Facebook and YouTube already has a, a live video broadcast. So if mm-hmm. you click here, uh, they they can bring uh, the uh, scene here like this, and then we can connect this and select the uh, uh, recorder record video, mm-hmm. and then we can connect the uh, audio. For example, let's say uh, my eye is not good, but anyway here then you will see the audio. And then I can show this and uh, uh, friend from the PAL or PHA? PAL. Okay, once I do this way, Mm. and then I can go live. Mm. That means one, two, one, now you can watch from from smart device. Your friend, for example, can mm-hmm. see now because it's live now. Mm-hmm. So this, this is the power that eStudio can broadcast. The only thing is you can broadcast here, drawings. So even you can bring your notebook to any place, like you are traveling from Nepal to here. Yeah. You can do live lecture mm-hmm. from here. Mm-hmm. So uh, eStudio really bring presentation uh, class in any place. As long as you bring your note, you can see. Here we have a friends coming. They mm-hmm. can see now. You can see how many people are uh, connected. Mm-hmm. So today we have a uh, Shiva from yeah. from uh, Nepal, right? Yes. Uh, Hirosan, can you can you give that microphone to Shiva? Here, no, yeah, no, the other side. Okay. Side. Yeah, you can you can, you can take side. this and turn on. Can you uh, talk anything today? Yeah. Good morning to <laughs> have uh, all friends in the world. Yeah, you can watch here. that camera, the, the top. We are the here to give something message to the world and converse our science and technology. Yeah, we are, today we are discussing how we bring the education classroom to Nepal. Yes. Nepal has a, a lot of uh, students who really want to have a good education. Yeah. But because of the distance and also because of the some special environment, yeah, so they have a, a quite big difficulty to to get good a lesson from mm-hmm. on other countries. Yeah. Many students now actually studying in other countries, right? Yeah. So uh, uh, Shiv is working for a non-profitable organization yeah. to bring all the nice cultures to Nepal. Mm-hmm. And now we are trying to bring some content from Korea, Japan, Hong yeah. Kong, and also mm-hmm. from, from USA, uh, anywhere. So what I'm proposing is we can give eStudio a machine mm-hmm. So any classroom, they can, they can live broadcast, just like we are doing. Whatever mm-hmm. the teacher is showing on the project screen, we can combine here, teacher yeah. and teaching material. So this one can go uh, everywhere in the Nepal schools. That's what yes. we are really trying to bring these uh, things. My, my yeah. proposal is uh, f- uh, several schools like uh, UC mm-hmm. Berkeley or Harvard mm-hmm. or MIT. Yes. Just a... Uh, uh, Nepal government proposed yeah. some help. So yeah. as a te- as a testing classroom, mm. Mm. some class in uh, in in any university in USA, England, whatever, mm. they can do live lecture. We can open two classrooms simultaneously, mm. so all the students can see each other, and all the class has the same teacher's video as you are watching now. Mm-hmm. That way, we can test the. Uh, how we can make a virtual class, which the teacher can teach from anywhere, mm-hmm. and students can be uh, everywhere. This is so once this one really uh, success, mm-hmm. then we can use that technology to change the education paradigm in Nepal. Yeah. It will be very cost effective, mm-hmm. and also it will be uh, very good for your uh, non profitable organization activities, I believe. Yeah, so thank you very much. So you got the idea how we do this. Ba- yeah. Basically, now this is a PowerPoint file from the notebook. I'm using eStudio Station, so we can change all the things, and you can erase this part. Mm-hmm. 
and also you can uh, connect other other parts. So this one just showing video. If you have a video from your mobile phone, you can bring all the video there. You can mm -hmm. bring the picture. You can bring the PowerPoint. And also you can bring another Chromecast input from your mobile. Mm -hmm. And also you have a camera. And again, we can bring the desktop capture, which means now, for example, if I try to show the, uh, the Facebook screen, I mm -hmm. can bring this Facebook. So exactly what eStudio screen we are using can be shown on here. So mm -hmm. you can draw. This is the eStudio program. This is the input switcher for uh, presenting material. Here we have a screen for the, uh, the Facebook. Mm -hmm. That's all about the, uh, the eStudio for live broadcasting. So mm -hmm. presentation can be made to any place in the world as long as people has a, a mobile phone. Mm -hmm. And another advantage is, uh, in, in this case, we have uh, the, uh, the, the video automatically recorded in Facebook. Mm -hmm. So this Facebook video doesn't mean live video only. It's mm -hmm. like a TV broadcasting, every people watch. Yeah. If they miss, they should pay something to see again. Mm -hmm. But Facebook video, once we do this kind of a presentation, this one recorded there automatically, so mm -hmm. students can see any time. There's a big power of smart classroom mm -hmm. made by eStudio and, and other product from Tarim. Mm -hmm. So what we are emphasizing is watching classroom lesson can be converted to the smart lesson, smart mm -hmm. class. So we call this is a new definition of smart classroom. Mm -hmm. So far, every people thinking smart class is the class where the mm -hmm. smart device is using. Mm -hmm. But now we are emphasizing the real smart class means smart mm -hmm. classroom can be shown in the smart device in any place, any time. Mm -hmm. All the uh, network connection, all the uh, the Wi-Fi, all the smart device. More than 7.5 billion devices are already installed in everywhere in the world. Mm. And all the smart devices connected. It's a really virtually one connected world. Mm. You can talk to them. You can show yeah. what you are doing here without any payment, mm. as long as you have a smart device. Mm. Then the, the step we have to move is we have to bring the way how we make a telepresentation. Mm. So far, telepresentation Technology is not defined, not existed. Mm -hmm. The e-studio is the easiest way to make this one happen. Mm -hmm. I hope you understand what we are yeah. trying and we really uh, make this happen in this planet. Yeah, fantastic. Mm. Can you uh, tell anything about your... <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, it is uh, surprising to me to such a technology mm. to came and uh, you have this, uh, the new innovation uh, in Korea. So mm. that connect people the world and share the knowledge and technologies then where we can need it mm. that uh, human being can prosper or have a same uh, like a global education and have a chance to one place to not going to the the place where it's expensive other things and people can leave the one place where they can have a chance to see everything and uh, receive the such knowledge mm. globally yeah. it is very it is very surprising to me to let people know mm. uh, should know this thing uh, especially the university mm. uh, uh, that can this is the era can get the technology and science yeah, yeah. thank you so much it comes out with that. Yeah, uh, I can shortly uh, show a little bit more about functionality mm -hmm. of eStudio can do. Basically, as long as you have a, a GTX uh, chipset on your notebook or on your mm -hmm. computer, you can basically use eStudio. Mm -hmm. The simplest way is notebook has a USB camera, so we can mm -hmm. show USB camera here. Mm -hmm. And you have a PowerPoint on the notebook. Mm. Then you can design the AR studio like I'm doing. For example, I can, I can remove mm. the, uh, the simple uh, decoration like this. Mm -hmm. So this is the PowerPoint frame. And also this frame, PowerPoint file and the frame, we also can change the frame, anything like this. Mm -hmm. This is the uh, uh, idea how we change the frame because frame always consisting Mm -hmm. and uh, some decoration there. So it will mm -hmm. stay all the presentation 
for 30 minutes, one hour. So the, mm-hmm. this frame is actually uh, taking very important role for designing the uh, video from there. Mm-hmm. And the other thing is we have a background here. You can bring some background like this. Mm-hmm. And then this one can go, for example, like this way. And we can make a slightly uh, reduce. And then you can bring this one over here. Mm-hmm. And that will bring uh, quite beautiful. Now this part is slightly uh, not beautiful. Then you can also can make uh, that part slightly beautifully decorate. Oh. And also there we can put some frame which make uh, a little bit uh, beautiful uh, the, the f- uh, part. And then once we have this, this color and those color, you can slightly change the, uh, this part to match mm-hmm. the beautifully uh, like this. Mm-hmm. And then uh, this, this one bring a little bit better studio. Mm-hmm. At the same time, we have a capability of changing colors. So it will mm-hmm. make uh, some different feeling. Oh. And all these tools is, uh, is a, a very easy mouse operated tool. All the nice content we are providing for you to use immediately without, without creation. Because this is uh, another power we are trying to build the new AR studio mm-hmm. by any novice people. Mm-hmm. So the e-studio has uh, several features that mm-hmm. we have uh, uh, the quite uh, interesting future mm-hmm. that you can create the studio by yourself. For yeah, example, yeah. here yeah. we have uh, uh, the first stage, as like I'm showing you, make uh, your own AL studio. I'm mm-hmm. not using any chroma key. That means you mm-hmm. can do this presentation from okay. any place in the world. Mm-hmm. And the other part here is the camera switching. Mm-hmm. So. Even we have one camera, you can make a camera action like a zooming, zooming mm-hmm. out, switching from here to there. So mm-hmm. basically it has a camera switching mm-hmm. from the live camera. I mean, your USB camera, whatever. Mm-hmm. The other one is a presenting material. So for everybody who are their presentation, they make a switching. Mm-hmm. Every broadcast equipment designed for switching from input, mm-hmm. from mm-hmm. camera to any material. Yeah. But now we are providing you virtual classroom where we can show teacher and teaching material in a virtual, this is actually not virtual, but augmented reality studio. So I call this is the AR classroom. Mm-hmm. So e-studio bring the teacher and teaching material in a AR classroom where the students can concentrate watching teacher mm-hmm. or concentrate on watching the presenting material. Mm-hmm. So sometimes you can just make a teacher's video. Sometimes mm-hmm. you can make a presentation only. But sometimes mm-hmm. you have to make a combine. It's like you are watching in the classroom oh, where yeah, the teacher yeah. and teaching mm-hmm. material exist. Mm-hmm. So that, that way we now bring the idea how we make mm-hmm. a presentation uh, to make it possible for tele, tele presentation. So all this future, the, the, the studio design and also virtual camera movement mm-hmm. and also we are providing electric whiteboard because the presentation yeah. means, huddle looms means there is a, mm-hmm. there is a blackboard. Yeah, yeah. The, now we are bringing virtual electric whiteboard where you can show any input and also you can make a pointer here and also you can make a drawing. Mm-hmm. So after this, we have all the live presentation tools we support, real-time switching, mixing, without any worry about switcher. So mm-hmm. you don't need any operator around you. Mm-hmm. This whole design is made for self-presentation. Mm-hmm. It's not designed for other person to operate this. Mm-hmm. This is a fundamental difference between eStudio and Tari My Studio product line mm-hmm. from other broadcast equipment. So there's, there's a whole, whole thing. That's why this is a live smart presentation means mm-hmm. you just do concentrate on, on your presentation. Mm-hmm. You don't have to worry about anything else. Mm-hmm. It's like you do presentation in the classroom. You just mm-hmm. make a next slide changing, next slide changing. Mm-hmm. But all the pointer is always you use. Pointer and next slide is the only device you are using in the classroom. Mm-hmm. Now this is exactly what we are doing that way. Just mm-hmm. a pointer and changing yeah. and you draw. Mm-hmm. So that, that's a whole thing you do. Then all the rest part mm-hmm. doing by the uh, intelligent way by this machine. Mm-hmm. And then all the uh, streaming, broadcasting, everything done by the other uh, software which we made already. So mm-hmm. you don't have to worry about anything except presenting yourself. So you have to concentrate your presentation. Then all automatic, beautiful video switching, mixing, streaming, recording mm-hmm. is made. 
So you can take this video after this presentation because we already recorded it. And yeah. also you can show this one right now to your friend to watch your uh, Facebook. If you make a uh, sharing, every yeah. people can see. So uh, thank you very much for yeah. uh, watching what eStudio can do. I hope this one really changing the way of presentation. Every people thinking presentation has to be made uh, from one place. Now mm -hmm. that's why you came here to see how yeah. it works. Yeah. But actually to have this presentation, you don't have to come. You can watch the same thing because yeah. you are sitting, yeah. not watching me, but you are watching there. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So why, yeah. Uh, that means you watch that screen, so you mm -hmm. completely understand. That means all the people are watching my Facebook, the same, mm -hmm. same feeling. They yeah. don't have to come to have this video because watching this video actually yeah. better than watching from my room. Yeah. So that means the classroom can be uh, shown by the uh, uh, e-studio mm -hmm. to any smart device in the world. So mm -hmm. we, I'm, I'm emphasizing this technology. It's, uh, it looks like a s simple broadcast software, but it has a lot of different technology inside. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you very much for... Yeah, thank you. Just I have one question. Yeah. So how long takes to, uh, this, uh, create this and then people how easily learn? The, how many... How many times it takes long to people can operate? Uh, actually, uh, once you open this template, uh, for example, I can show this uh, eStudio uh, menu. Uh, for example, now I can, I can bring the eStudio function. So this is the eStudio program, as you see here. Mm -hmm. So once you go studio, I'm sorry, this is Korean now. Of course, English version yeah, we yeah, have. Yeah, okay, so we have uh, several examples here. This is called profile. Mm -hmm. So when you have a standing profile, you can make a standing profile selection. When you want to have a sitting profile, you can select sitting profile. Mm -hmm. If you load, it, it shows several examples, several uh, nice uh, uh, AR studio already. Mm -hmm. So basically, you don't need to do anything. You just bring PowerPoint connection and you do presentation. Mm -hmm. But when you change to make a nicer studio, yes, you can easily change from the database we are providing you. Mm -hmm. So you don't have to actually create, but you can use the background. You can use a lot of uh, different frames we already provide. Mm -hmm. But of course, you can do by yourself to create your own style there. Mm -hmm. So basically, we are emphasizing any teacher to bring their USB. And you just connect, and he just present without mm -hmm. learning. Within mm -hmm. two or three minutes, they can do. Mm -hmm. And also, we have a pointer. Once you have this kind of pointer, I mean, this is the uh, uh, general gyro pointer. It's not special e-studio pointer. It's a mm -hmm. kind of uh, the, uh, the uh, general pointer. So once you have uh, uh, this pointer, you can use this pointer only. It's like you do this. Right now, the battery here uh, is not, not here. But anyway, you yeah. can do this mm -hmm. one. Okay. So that, that's the whole idea to mm -hmm. have this. As you see here, this, this screen, the presenting material, we call this, this screen is a virtual electric whiteboard. Mm -hmm. There we can show many things. Mm -hmm. We can show this uh, PowerPoint from my notebook. Mm -hmm. So the teacher from classroom, mm -hmm. uh, it's like we show here, the, the, this teacher uh, showing east to the output directly in the classroom. Mm -hmm. We emphasize showing is to the app in the classroom actually uh, make a better concentration for the students. Mm -hmm. One of the reasons is when you have a little bit bigger, bigger screen here, the teacher's size here is much bigger than normal teacher. Mm -hmm. Assuming you, are, you have a big classroom where 100 students there, mm -hmm. the watching teacher's face, where all the, the emotional things is showing, mm -hmm. is not actually transferred to the students properly because the lighting Mm -hmm. and also size of the face. Mm -hmm. Imagine about 500 conference hall, almost impossible. Mm -hmm. But once you use this way, the big screen, always showing big actor, teacher's face, mm -hmm. showing their gestures and emotions. Mm -hmm. Same time, you can also showing the teaching material efficiently. Mm -hmm. That's why all the way of presentation in the classroom can be c completely changed the way using eStudio or mStudio much better, mm -hmm. whatever. So that's the uh, message I'm trying to bring in this industry, how we change, how we uh, use the e-studio or i-studio technology in the classroom. Mm -hmm. So e-studio, i-studio is not only recording device. E-studio, i-studio is the teaching device. Mm -hmm. It's like a PowerPoint. It's like a project screen. Yeah. We want to bring this i-studio, e-studio in every classroom for them to make uh, their valuable presentation mm -hmm. for smart class. Mm -hmm. Once they teach using i-studio and e-studio, you have the video which can mm -hmm. stay forever. Mm -hmm. So maybe a thousand years later, people can see this video again, 
even yeah. you passed away. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah thank you so much. Yeah. So, okay, thank you very much yeah, for so much uh, and, uh, sharing this. Uh, yeah, mm. this is great. Yeah, thank you for hard work. So uh, when you have this one, we can uh, complete the music. This is the new message we are trying to bring the uh, industry. Thank you very much, Shiva, yeah. to coming yeah, in Nepal. I you. hope yeah. we work together so, to realize yeah. this kind of work.